there's literally a guy sitting in the balcony just watching me right now because I'm sitting in front of my window and he's sitting on his balcony and we're literally facing each other. Hey sir, do you like the hair? Yeah, it's by Ava Wigs. Mm -hmm. Oh, you do? I do too, girl. I'm trying to think of a new intro because I hate. Hi, you guys. Girl, bye. So, you're going to be able to hear the geese. I apologize, but I can't do anything about it. Today's video, I am reviewing this wig right here. So I'm reviewing this wig right here. Shut the fuck up. I'm reviewing this wig right here. I posted on Snapchat today a picture of me with this hair and a lot of people were like, oh my God, girl, your hair, like, oh my God. And so I wanted to talk about it and do a review because this is the second day I've worn it for the full day. And so I have a bit more experience with it as opposed to if, like I just tried it on for a video, you know? I need the box. <clears throat> There's like a ton of trash stuck to it. So the wig is by avahair.com and the box looks like this. It's a very sleek, sh shiny box. I really like the packaging. And I believe this is my second wig from them. I'm not sure. I think it is. I think the last wig I got from them was like a minty green one. Before I get into it, let me show a video. Let me insert a clip of what the wig looks like off because I'm not about to just take this off and then like put it back on. So, boop. All right, so that's what it looks like off the head. Um, I obviously am wearing it in a half up, half down style right now. So this is in, the link and everything will be down below, but this is called the Dark Brown Synthetic Lace Front Wig with Sexy Wavy. That's what the title is, but again, if you want the direct link, it'll be down below. It says that it's 26 inches, 150% density and there is three clips the typical two right here and then one in the back and there is a drawstring so you can like tighten it and it, this is all this is all heat resistant as well but i like the pattern of it so i'm probably not going to touch it um so yeah the reason why i got this wig is i feel like you obviously can tell it really matches my natural hair color pretty well like all up here, this right here has a lot of my own hair in it. So I'm able to do that like whole half up, half down look. And yeah, I mainly wanted a wig that matched my hair color. So that's why I went with this. I was super pleasantly surprised with the quality of this wig. It is very, very soft, especially when you first get it. It does shed a little bit because I have worn it for two days. It does shed a tiny bit, but not like horribly if that makes sense like it's kind of just like average shedding it does matte a little bit so you're gonna want to probably brush it if you can because it does tangle and it does get a little matted but again it is not anything horrible like I could deal with it like I came home today and I actually haven't even brushed it from coming home so this is what it looks like after a day of wearing it but obviously if you brush it it'll probably look nicer but it's so like this is what a day of wear looks like as opposed to like a brush it. You can see the matting is not horrible. It does tangle a little bit. I wanted to let you guys know because I'm always curious about that because I know some synthetic wigs, like I have this one girl, there's no fucking way I'm wearing it out and about because it will just be one ball of It'll be like a giant hairball if I wear it out of the house. It is so bad with the tangling and stuff, so there's no way. So I'm always curious, like, if it's going to tangle and stuff. Personally, I feel like this does look very realistic. I don't want to be mean, but on the site, I don't know. It did look a little bit fake, like, when I was looking at the picture. 
I was ple more pleasantly surprised when it came in the mail because it looked more realistic than it did on site, which is a plus, but what else can I say? You could wear this, like, you see, I have a half, I can't, obviously I fucking have a half up, half down. However, you can part it, but the way the wig goes, which hopefully I could show in the little clip that I showed, maybe even right now, it's not like... I don't know like it doesn't have like a structured part it does give you like you're able to customize there's literally a guy sitting in the balcony just watching me right now because I'm sitting in front of my window and he's sitting on his balcony and we're literally facing each other hey sir do you like the hair yeah it's by Ava Wigs mm -hmm. oh you do I do too girl oh fuck what was I even saying oh but yeah like it I find it a little hard to wear it normal like just a like if I just put the wig on normal I feel like it could look a little fake so just as a warning I don't know I don't know if that even makes sense but to me it does also I haven't done anything to this hair this is straight out of the box I haven't dry shampooed it I haven't baby powdered it I haven't put a hair dryer on it it is very very low maintenance which is me like literally me I saw this one girl who did like how to make your wigs look more natural video. She literally was like blow drying, fucking baby powdering, doing all this shit. And I was just like, girl, I don't want to do all that. Like, that's cool, but I want something that's like I don't have to deal with. I don't even think I said the price. This hair is retails for $119. So yeah, would I recommend this wig? abso freaking Luli. I've gotten so many compliments on this hair and it is such like i said a low maintenance you don't have to do very much yes it is a little more pricey but for me for a wig like this i would buy this if i had to if i knew the stuff i know now having it and i had to like if if ava wigs was like okay send it back i would and i like had to i would send it back and then i would buy it because that's honestly how much I like it and I've gotten plenty of wigs where I'm like girl I would never buy this with my own money um or like not necessarily that that sounds so bad they weren't horrible but I was like girl should it really be this expensive I don't know so yeah tell me what you guys think I love this hair and I know some of you did too and yeah I love you and I'll talk to you guys in the next video bye